So we have map, we have filter, and we have reduce. So this looks like something that works on functional programming. If you go to Haskell and if you go to F Sharp, they can reproduce all of these functions in one single query, one single function. But in JavaScript, it will inspect the whole collection on map. We will get our salary from map. We will inspect the whole collection again in the salary. And if you match this query, we will use reduce and we will just go away three times. So we have a million employees. We run like three million uh, interaction, so maybe it's not so good, but it's fine. We have like 200 milliseconds. It's not that good. It's not that bad. But imagine if you just change this code for uh, interactive code. Oh, this is so polemic. If you have a, just change the algorithm. Like here, I have a code that looks like more, I don't know, more uglier than the other. But when we run this code, we have 20 seconds, like 10, 10 times faster than the another approach. I'm not talking about avoiding using map. I'm not talking about it, uh, avoiding use reduce and filter. Just to look if you really, really need to use these functions when you're doing your application.